Unit Six: Dinosaurs. Listening and grammar. One. Listen and find the dinosaur. My favorite dinosaurs. Action time. Which number is this dinosaur? Four. Listen and practice the prepositions. One. Near. Two. Next to. Three. In front of. Four. Behind. Five. Under. Six. On. Seven. In. Five. Make pairs. One person says the position of a dinosaur on page fifty. The other person says its name, like this. This dinosaur is near Velociraptor. I know, Protoceratops. That's right. Now you say one. Okay. This dinosaur is behind Stegosaurus. I know, Iguanodon. Yes. Speaking and brainstorming. Amazing facts about dinosaurs. One, listen and fill in the amazing facts. One, the largest dinosaur was Argentinosaurus. It measured about thirty meters from head to tail and weighed about eighty tons. That's eighty thousand kilograms. Two, the biggest meat-eating dinosaur was Spinosaurus. It was up to eighteen meters long. It had a big fin like a sail along its back, and long, sharp claws. Three. The fastest dinosaur was Ornithomimus. This ostrich-like dinosaur could run about forty kilometers per hour. Four. The dinosaur with the most teeth was Hadrosaur. It was a plant eater with a mouth like a giant duck. It had about nine hundred and sixty teeth. Make pairs and tell your partner two amazing facts about two dinosaurs. Did you know that Spinosaurus was up to eighteen meters long, and that Argentinosaurus weighed eighty thousand kilograms? Wow, that's amazing! Did you know that Ornithomimus could run about forty kilometers per hour, and that Hadrosaur had about nine hundred and sixty teeth? Really? Wow! Action time. Dinosaur two hints game. Four. 
Play the Dinosaur 2 hints game. 1. Make groups. One person says two things about a dinosaur on page 52. 2. The others try to guess the name. 3. The person who guesses correctly chooses a different dinosaur and says two hints. 4. Keep playing until everyone has said two hints. This dinosaur was the largest dinosaur. It weighed around 80 tons. I know. It's Argentinosaurus. Yes, it is. Okay. This dinosaur was a meat eater, and it was up to 18 meters long. I know. It's Spinosaurus. Yes, that's right. My turn. This dinosaur was like an ostrich and could run about 40 kilometers per hour. I know. Ornithomimus. Yes, that's right. <laughs> Writing and presentation. Numbers and very big numbers. 1. Listen and write the missing numbers. 1. A spaceship can travel about 40,000 kilometers in one hour. 2. There are about 375,000 different types of beetle. 3. There are about 1 million letters in a 500-page book. 4. McDonald's sells about 550 million hamburgers every year in the USA. 5. A flea can jump 1 centimeter. So, if it jumped 1 billion times, it could jump from Tokyo to Chicago. 6. There are about 6 billion 800 million people on Earth. Action Time Essay Writing Big Numbers 3. Listen and read the sample essay. Big numbers are really interesting. They help us count. Did you know that there are now about 6 billion 800 million people on Earth? In 1800, there were fewer than 1 billion. So, in just 200 years, there are more than 6 times as many people. By 2050, there will be nearly 9 billion people. Phew! Reading and Thinking 1. Listen, read, and number the pictures. Finding Dinosaurs My name is Ruben Carolini, and I live in Argentina. I'm a car mechanic, but I also have an unusual hobby. I hunt for dinosaur bones. I look for them in a place called Dinosaur Valley, which is near my home. One day, in 1993, I found some really huge bones. I didn't know what dinosaur they were from. I had never seen bones like them before. I was very excited, so I called some professors I knew. They came and dug them up and studied them. They found they had come from a meat-eater even bigger than Tyrannosaurus. I was very proud because they named the new dinosaur after me. It's called Gigantosaurus carolini. Gigantosaurus means gigantic lizard. I'm now the manager of a dinosaur museum. Gigantosaurus carolini is here too. Maybe one day, if you try really hard, you could discover a new dinosaur too. Action Time 
Four, make pairs. Read the story to each other. Answer the questions. First, listen and read the questions. One, who discovered Gigantosaurus? Two, what country was he from? Three, what was his job? Four, what was his hobby? Five. When did he discover Gigantosaurus? Six. Which was bigger, Tyrannosaurus or Gigantosaurus? Now read the story to each other, then answer the questions with your partner. Five. Chat with your teacher and friends. First, listen and read the questions. One. What's your favorite dinosaur? Why? Two. Would you like to look for dinosaur bones? Three. What kind of dinosaur would you like to find? Why? Now chat about the questions like this. What's your favorite dinosaur? It's Tyrannosaurus. Why? Because it's the strongest and the scariest. Would you like to look for dinosaur bones? Yes, I would. I think it would be really interesting. What kind of dinosaur would you like to find? Tyrannosaurus, of course. Why? Because it's my favorite, and it's the best. What about you? What's your favorite dinosaur?